If you could just go ahead and make sure you do that from now on, that would be great. And uh, I'll go ahead and make sure you get another copy of that memo, okay? In the future, you may be spending less time in that cubicle checking memos and more time ridding your golf game of that slice, at least according to billionaire Mets owner Steve Cohen. He told CNBC he believes innovations in artificial intelligence and the wide-held belief that work productivity dips on Fridays leads him to one conclusion. My belief is a four-day work week. Work week is coming. Cohen said it's part of what inspired him to invest in TGL, a startup golf league. But that should fit into a theme of more leisure for people, uh, which means golf rounds will go up. So where does AI fit in? A recent study shows gains in AI could reduce the work week to 32 hours for 28 percent of U.S. and U.K. workforces by 2033. And get this, there'd be no change to pay. The data predicts mundane tasks will eventually be done by AI, reducing the need for workers to clock in for 40 hours. Researchers went on to say the tasks would be achieved by bringing apps like ChatGPT and large language models on board. And with their additions, it's estimated hours could be reduced by 10 percent. We've previously reported on Senator Bernie Sanders' proposed bill to shorten the work week to 32 hours. But that doesn't appear to be gaining much traction in Washington. And thousands of firms across the U.K. experimented with the world's largest 32-hour workweek trial. Of the companies, 91 percent decided to continue the practice. A pilot program in Spain found people felt less stress, were less tired, and had more time for things they enjoy. So there might be something to Cohen's theory about more rounds of golf. But if you work for Cohen, don't expect to see the change. He says if the market stays open on Friday, traders will be working. But he still believes the vast majority of workers are on track for a four-day work week.